everybody and welcome to Markham Public Library's Virtual Circle Time. My name is Amber and I'll be doing circle time with you today. Are you ready to get started? Okay, let's start with two songs. All right. Hello everybody and how are you? How are you? How are you? Hello everybody and how are you? How are you today? Come on everybody and clap your hands. Clap your hands. Clap your hands. Come on everybody and clap your hands. Clap your hands today. Come on everybody and stomp your feet. Stomp your feet. Stomp your feet. Come on everybody and stomp your feet. Stomp your feet today. Very good. All right, let's do one more song, okay? The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. Cause your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. Now we're going to do the more we read together. The more we read together, 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 the more we read together, the happier we'll be. Because your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends. The more we read together, the happier we'll be. Very good. So we're in winter season now. So we're going to be doing winter story time today. So look, our first book is The Thing About Yetis by Vin Vogel, published and used with permission by Dial Books for Young Readers. I love yetis. Isn't this a cute little yeti? Hey, let's get started. The thing about Yetis is that Yetis love winter. Do you love winter? They love waking up on a snowy and quiet mornings and drinking hot chocolate with their favorite stuffed toy. Ooh, hot chocolate, yummy. They love sliding down the hills on their bottoms building big snow castles. Oh, that looks like fun. And pretending they are gods of all. They love ice skating, yeti style. Look, they skate off their tummies. Yetis make the best snowballs on the planet. And the best snowman, too. But sometimes winter can be tough, even for a Yeti. After all, Yetis get cold, too. Really, really cold. And when their snowy fur finally dry, it gets a little... Oh, it gets a little wet. <gasps> Poofy! Isn't that funny? Look at it. He looks like a poof ball there. On those days when Yetis just can't get warm and the box of hot chocolate is empty. Oh no, what's Yeti going to do? Yetis can get down right crabby. So here's a little secret for you. The thing about Yetis is that sometimes they miss they miss playing outside for hours and hours on long sunny days. They miss looking for little creatures by the sea and having sea monster beauty contests. Look at those silly faces. Yetis miss building big sand castles and pretending they are gods of love. They miss zipping down splashy slides on their bellies. Oh, they have lots of fun in the summer. They miss wishing on a shooting star, the glowing light show of hundreds of fireflies, and the sound of crickets on warm summer nights. The thing about yetis is that yetis love winter because on the very coldest, wettest, windiest winter days, yetis know just what to do. What do you think yetis going to do? They make the warmest, coziest, calmest summer day right at home. Look at what you can do at home. You can pretend it's summer right inside and be warm and cozy even if it's snowing really bad outside. That's a good 
good idea, right? All right, let's do a run. Let's see what I got. Oh, got a little penguin. Okay, penguin, penguin, stand up tall. Penguin, penguin, make yourself small. Penguin, penguin, waddle to the left. Penguin, penguin, waddle to the right. Penguin, penguin, sweep for love, sweep, sweep, sweep. Penguin, penguin, wave to the crowd, wave to the crowd. Penguin, penguin, take a bow. Penguin, penguin, just say, wow. Penguin, penguin, dance around. Penguin, penguin, sit back down. Oh, and who's a penguin's friend? The Yeti! Yeti Yeti, stop around! Yeti Yeti, ready, touch the ground! Yeti Yeti Yeti, jump up and down, up and down! Yeti Yeti Yeti, sit real still! Yeti Yeti Yeti, roar real loud! Yeti Yeti Yeti, shh, stay really quiet! Yeti Yeti Yeti, oh, hi! Yeti Yeti Yeti, take a peek! Penny, name. Ready? Take a seat. All right, let's get out our fingers, okay? One little, two little, three little snowflakes, four little, five little, six little snowflakes, seven little, eight little, nine little snowflakes, ten little snowflakes. My hat! Oh, let's do this again. One little, two little, three little snowflakes, four little, five little, six little snowflakes, seven little, eight little, nine little snowflakes, ten little snowflakes on my boots. One little, two little, three little snowflakes, four little, five little, six little snowflakes, seven little, eight little, nine little snowflakes, ten little snowflakes on my mittens. All right, one more time. One little, two little, three little snowflakes, four little, five little, six little snowflakes, seven little, eight little, nine little snowflakes, ten little snowflakes falling down. Very good with your fingers. Let's count. Let's do another book. This one's called No to a Life by Keith Baker, published and used with permission by Beach Lane Books. Oh, this one's got lots of snowflakes on it and two little birds. Oh, look at all the snowflakes. And there's the birdies in their house. No two snowflakes are alike. Almost. No two nests so soft and round. Look, there's a squirrel. No two tracks upon the ground. No two branches, no two leaves. No two forests full of trees. Oh, what other animal we see there? A fox. No two fences long and low. No two roads. Where do they go? Do we see the two roads? There's a car at the end of this one. Nothing's at the end of that one. No two bridges, wood or stone. No two houses. Anyone home? There is someone home in that house. No two friends, large or small. See all the different types of birds and an owl. Among you all, look at all the different animals. What do we have here? We've got deer, we've got a bear, we've got the foxes, there's a squirrel, a 
and there's lots and lots of different birds and some bunnies. Are we the same? Just alike? Are the two red birds just the same? Almost. Almost. But not quite. See their feathers? One's all red and one's red and a little black. Those are one of us. Those are nice both of different animals in the winter, right? Alright, then let's do a song about different more animals in the winter. Let's see what different ones we've got, okay? <gasps> What's this one? A polar bear, that's right. All right, polar bear, polar bear. All right. Okay, let's start our song. If you're polar bear and you know it, give a roar. Roar! If you're polar bear and you know it, give a roar. Roar! If you're polar bear and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're polar bear and you know it, give a roar. Roar! What do we got next? Oh, my thing. If you're a penguin and you know it, waddle around. If you're a penguin and you know it, waddle around. If you're a penguin and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're a penguin and you know it, waddle around. What do we got next? Oh, this one's a rabbit, but it's a white rabbit. So we call that one an arctic hare. If you're an arctic hare and you know it, give a hop. If you're an arctic hare and you know it, give a hop. If you're an arctic hare and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're an arctic hare and you know it, give a hop. Oh, what else do we have? Oh, this one's an owl and it's a white one so it's called a snowy owl. If you're a snowy owl and you know it, give a hop. Let me hear you. If you're a snowy owl and you know it, give a hop. If you're a snowy owl and you know it and you really Want to show it if you're snowy owl and you know it, give up. Very good. Ooh, look, it's a bird, just like the one in the book, right? A red bird. All right, if you're a bird and you know it, tweet for luck. If you're a bird and you know it, tweet for luck. If you're a bird and you know it and you really want to show it, if you're a bird and you know it, tweet for luck. If you're a fox and you know it, give a yow. If you're a fox and you know it, give a yow. If you're a fox and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're a fox and you know it, give a yow. We've got one more. It's our Yeti back again. If you're a Yeti and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're a Yeti and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're a Yeti and you know it and you really want to show it, if you're a Yeti and you know it, stomp your feet. Very good. Okay, now, children learn language through repetition, and as songs are repeated through the rhythm of the words, they're internalized. So we're going to do a song and we're going to repeat it, because repetition is really good, okay? All right, this one's about snowflakes. All right, so get ready. Snowflakes, snowflakes. Dance around. Ooh, snowflakes, snowflakes, touch the ground. Snowflakes, snowflakes, in the air. Snowflakes, snowflakes, everywhere. All right, let's do that again. Snowflakes, snowflakes, dance around. Snowflakes, snowflakes, touch the ground. Snowflakes, snowflakes, in the air. Snowflakes, snowflakes, Everywhere. All right, one more time. Snowflakes, snowflakes, dance around. Snowflakes, snowflakes, touch the ground. Snowflakes, snowflakes, in the air. Snowflakes, snowflakes, everywhere. Very good. All right, we've got one more book. The Hockey Song Book by Stomp and Tom Connors, illustrated by Perry Clement, published and used with permission by Greystone Books. Oh, this one's a classic one. Oh, there's our hockey players. 
Oh, they're getting all laced up with their hockey skates. What a great winter activity, right? Oh, there we go. Hello out there, we're all in the air. It's hockey night tonight. Tension grows, the whistle blows, and the puck goes down the ice. The goalie jumps and the players bump and the fans all go, it's Someone roars, butter scores at the good old hockey game. Oh, the good old hockey game is the best game you can name. And the best game you can name is the good old hockey game. Second period. Oh, the players dash with skates a flash. The home team trails behind. But they grab the puck and go bursting up, and they're down across the line. They storm the crease like bumblebees. They travel like a burning flame. We see them slide. The puck inside. It's a one-one hockey game. Oh, the good old hockey game is the best game you can name. And the best game you can name is a good old hockey game. Third period, last game in the playoffs, too. Oh, take me where the hockey players face off down the rink. And the Stanley Cup is all filled up for the chance to win the drink. Now the final pluck of a hockey stick and the one gigantic stream. The puck is in! The home team wins the good old hockey game. Oh, the good old hockey game is the best game you can name. And the best game you can name is a good old hockey game. Group picture. And there they go, back home. Do you guys play hockey or some other winter sports? Oh, you had snowshoeing or skiing, maybe skiing cross country or skiing downhill. How about skating? Or is hockey your favorite? Maybe curling, right? There's lots of different winter activities for you to try this winter, so try to try them all. I've done them all. You've got to try them. Okay, but maybe your sport is just breaking a really big snowman, right? That could be a sport. So let's do a snowman song. Oh, here we go. We got one, two, three. Three little snowmen out to play, out on a snowy winter's day. But out came the sun and stayed all day. And one of those snow friends melted away. How many do we have now? Two? One, two. That's right. Two little snowmen out to play, out on a snowy winter's day. Out came the sun and stayed all day. And one of those snowmen melted away. Oh, we've got one now. Just one. One little snowman out to play, out on a snowy winter's day. Out came the sun and stayed all day. And that one little snowman melted away. How many do we have now? Zero. That's right. No little snowman came out to play, out on a snowy winter's day. Out came some children. And stayed all day and they built one, Two, three new snowmen! Yay! Lots of little snowmen. You should keep building them, right? That's fun to build a friend. All right, let's do another song, okay? Here we go round the mulberry bush, mulberry bush, mulberry bush. Here we go round the mulberry bush on a cold and frosty morning. This is the way we clap our hands, clap our hands, clap our hands. This is the way we clap our hands on a cold and frosty morning. This is the way we wash our hands, wash our hands, wash our hands. This is the way we wash our hands on a cold and frosty morning.
This is the way we stomp our feet, stomp our feet, stomp our feet. This is the way we stomp our feet on a cold and frosty morning. This is the way we say goodbye, say goodbye, say goodbye. This is the way we say goodbye on a cold and frosty morning. That's it for now. We got two more closing songs. All right, get ready. Hands go up, hands go down. I can twirl them round and round. I can stomp upon two shoes. I can clap and so can you clap your hands. I can wave, I'll show you how. Circle time is done for now. Our hands say thank you with the clap, clap, clap. Our feet say thank you with the tap, tap, tap. Clap, 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 tap, tap, tap. We roll our hands and we wave goodbye everybody. Thank you for coming to Circle Time today. We have Circle Time live on Facebook on Mondays and Fridays at 10 a.m. If you enjoyed today's virtual Circle Time, make sure you share with us some photos and tag us on Facebook and Instagram to tag Markham Public Library. We'll see you next time. Happy winter, everybody. Bye.